In 1914, the British Empire stood on the brink of a terrifying abyss. It seemed to some that the unthinkable would have to be contemplated. For 150 years, the cricket ball makers of Kent had supplied the entire empire with all its needs. But now, the amalgamated society of cricket ball makers had gone on strike. They wanted more pay. Would the season have to be cancelled? Fortunately, after a few weeks, good sense prevailed and an agreement was struck. Few people around the Empire realised just how perilously close they'd come to disaster. In 2006, the last of the cricket ball makers unions came to an end. It had just six members. But today, still all around the world, cricket balls are made with English leather. 